Pokemon just revealed its next upcoming set in the Scarlet and Violet era. This November, we're gonna be getting Surging Sparks. And today, we're gonna be looking at everything that got released. So they posted this today around three o'clock Eastern time. I'm assuming that's what it is. And it looks like they dropped the pack artworks, the booster box, the booster bundle, some triple pack blisters, and this new Horizons box that we're gonna look up in personal and close here in a minute. Here's a better picture of everything. So you got the Pikachu, the Latios and Latias, and you have the Executor, and then you have the building. Honestly, I've, I've seen some people hating online about the uh, lettering or the font that they use for this. I kind of like it. I'm not going to lie to you. I mean, the executor in the, in the building, who cares about that? But these two, those are fire, dude. Those are really, really nice sleeved packs. Those are going to be something I'm really looking forward to having in my collection. Booster box looks cool. The Pikachu. And now I know what you're thinking. Like, Zach, we've seen this before with Vivid Voltage. Here's why I think this is a little bit different than Vivid. Vivid had absolutely nothing to offer besides the rainbow Pikachu. Like, there was nothing else. There's no alt arts, nothing. This set's gonna have alt arts. We already seen some, we're gonna look at those. I'm sure you've seen them, but just in case you have it, we're gonna look at those too. I think that this set is going to be 10 times better than Vivid. I'm not gonna lie to you, this next little era that we're entering in Scarlet and Vire, I think is going to be absolutely insane. With the UPCs coming out, the Charizard figure coming out, I think Stellar Crown's gonna be really good. You have the Evolution set coming and you have the Rocket set coming. It is going to be a crazy next six months. But just looking at this uh, ETB, I really, I'm digging this, okay? Like this is 10 times better than a Vivid Voltage. I'm literally looking at the Vivid Voltage. It just doesn't do nothing for me. This is 10 times better, even with the stupid crown thing. I know a lot of people don't like this, which, you know, that's fair, but we're gonna get another rainbow Pikachu. That's what that tells me 100%. And what I think is gonna happen, I'm not 100% on this, but I would say Pikachu that they've been showing in Pokemon Pocket or whatever, is going to be in this set. Obviously, I don't know that for sure. Nobody does but the people in Pokemon, but I just have a strong feeling that's either gonna be the ETB promo or it is going to be the main chase of this set on top of the Rainbow Pikachu. Here we got a better look at the packs. It looks, I mean, I, I, these two for sure, like I said, these are gonna be sought after. These, eh, who cares? And then you got the triple pack blisters. I'm a huge triple pack blister guy. That This is my go-to for investing. If you look over the past couple years, Triple pack blisters have outperformed everything relative to how much they cost upon release. Well, I'm always a huge advocate for triple pack blisters. These look pretty good. The Zapdos is gonna do well at the Quagsire. Eh, the Zapdos is gonna do well though. And then here's the up close shot of the booster bundle. Once again, the Sparks looks all kinds of crazy. I really like this, I'm not gonna lie to you. And then this set is gonna be combining two sets from the Japanese side. This set is going to be a mashup of Paradise Dragona and Supercharged Breaker, which I guess that makes sense. The Paradise Dragona though, that one kind of caught me off guard because I, I was kind of thinking originally that they was just gonna straight up do a dragon set because you know that was the rumor. It looks like they went ahead and combined the two, it looks like. So the Paradise Dragona is going to be released in Japan on September 13th. So we'll have a really good look the first half of Surge and Sparks on that date. And just looking at some of the cards, I mean, you, like I said, that's gonna be the chase. I don't think anybody's really chasing the Executor. It would be kind of cool, I guess, to pull. I'm not gonna complain about it. But the Latios and Latias is definitely the chase. So here they are up close. I know a lot of people was like, well, why didn't they do an EX for both? I don't really know why. I don't know what the meaning is behind this. Maybe, I'm sure there's a reason somewhere. I mean, honestly, as a pitcher together, I think it looks good but personally they're kind of underwhelming they try to do the same color scheme as the lovebirds and i don't know it just doesn't hit the same i don't think but i don't know maybe i'm crazy definitely let me know down below what you think you have the execute on the freaking basketball court i guess i know it's not a basketball court but still it kind of looks like it and then you have this thing the dragon coconuts i don't know i don't know how that happened but we're here now, so it's a rainbow SIR. I mean, this is, it's getting crazy with Pokemon right now. I don't know what to say to you people. Last thing I wanted to talk about was the Grand Adventure Collection. So this thing definitely caught my eye because as you can see, it is the Pokemon Horizons, Terrapagos and Friends. So you got that little turtle guy right there and it's bringing the Horizons into the TCG. So this thing is pretty cool. I like it a lot. Um, it The color scheme on it reminds me of the uh, starter sword and shield boxes with the uh, score bunny and all of them. It kind of feels like the same vibe, but it looks like it's having stellar crown surging sparks. And I can't tell if that is obsidian flames. I think it's obsidian flames, but I don't know for sure. So 
Uh, the Obsidian is going to be kind of eh, but I think the Stellar Insurgent Sparks in the same box. I think that's pretty solid. I'm not going to open this thing, but I'm definitely going to uh, have this thing as a centerpiece in my collection for sure. I'm going to definitely stock up on these. So far, that's all we know about Surgeon Sparks. Let me know down below what you guys think about the set. Me personally, I'm really excited for it. Like I said earlier, I think the next six months of Pokemon is about to be absolutely insane. We're about to hit the golden pocket of the Scarlet and Violet era. So that means one thing. Get those wallets ready, baby, because they're going to be hurting. Everybody get your pre-order buttons ready. And let me know down below if you guys like this type of content. I'm trying something new. I don't get any views anyway, so what's it going to hurt, right? Thank you guys so much for watching. Happy collecting. Pokefactory out. Peace!